I'm going to have to do it. I'm going to scrape this bit off and try and make something that complements this. I need to do these colours on a separate canvas because they're absolutely gorgeous together. And I'll just stick with this colourful part for now. So if you don't like to see scraped paint, look away now. <laughs> so that wouldn't be any good for me to sell because it looks like two different paintings. So I'm going to... Ah! Oh, this is fun. I don't mind doing this. I'm going to try and scrape this painting into my jug. Might make a nice colour. There we go. Come on, Jilly, get your thinking cap on. Thinking cap. What can I do with this now? No, I can't. I've got to start from the beginning. That's it. Okay, loving that wicker. Wicker woo, wicker woo. Cool red, cool red. <coughs> this was cool green or oh green light with phthalo blue. How about that then? Made a lovely colour. Champagne colour, custom colour too. I might as well use the rest of them. I don't know, I'm going to really be pushing my luck here to get this to gel together now. Might end up swiping over the whole lot again. That would probably be the better idea. <coughs> yes, I think that will be the go is I swipe over the whole lot. I just tilt my colours back over like I did the first time, nice and slowly. Back over this way. I'm getting myself in a right arm mess today, but if you're not really not happy with something yourself, sometimes it's all right leaving it because other people will like it, but that definitely looked like two different paintings from two different artists, <laughs> even. So, I'm not that happy with it. I'm going to have to change it otherwise. But it probably would have been worth my while just starting again because look what I'm doing here. I'm... Um, really making a mess but I'll just go with it I've just got to keep tilting so I might tilt it out of the screen sorry about that I might just speed up all this bit of me plonking around <coughs> okay that's weird but anyway, I've done it, so, 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 I'm going to get that. So that's the Amsterdam Black with Floetrol. So I'm thinking, do I swipe it down maybe instead of along? Maybe. 
maybe I'll swipe it centerwise. Those cells are <coughs> absolutely stupendous. Is that a word? Stupendous. <coughs> Missed a bit. That's okay though. It doesn't matter. <laughs> that is unbelievable. I'm wondering what the extra bit I added to my, because I mean, Flow Trolleys does a wonderful job, but that's extra special. So, <clears throat> I get so many people saying to me that you make it look so easy and when they've come to do it, it's, it's harder. And that is so, but I truly, no, as with when I was started doing these, that it's a little harder to begin with, unless you're very lucky when you first do it and it turns out perfect. Um, it normally takes practice in trying to get your own mix right, because it is all to do with consistency as well as the, as the paint and the different paint products you use. That is absolutely crazy dory cells. That's uh, unbelievably gorgeous. Just like the bloom effect, but without doing the bloomy thing. This is like the very first painting that I think I did on YouTube was like this. <laughs> was the swipe down the center. I think I've taken it off now because the sound was so bad. That is crazy. I'm going to bring you down again for that. That is crazy, Seld. Oh my goodness. This is just crazy. Every colour pops. It really, really does. Ugh. Crazy, crazy crazy look at that the cells within cells that is crazy cool and it's absolutely glistening because of the pearl mist in some of the colors uh, i've told you lots of times that i love using the pearl mist and adding it in a lot of my dark colors <coughs> and it helps create this gorgeous shimmer 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 look at that this emerald colour. Wow, 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 wow. Everywhere I'm looking, it is just so crazy cool with these. Look a little champagne cells there. Oh, uh, this is the whole thing. I don't think I'm going to balloon kiss this. Can you believe it or not? It would really look nice when it's dry embellishing it as a reflection swipe sort of so i think i'm actually going to leave this one can you believe it or not i'd love to balloon it and actually use the balloon kisses from the from the um, balloon onto a whole different canvas because those colors look stunning there's the little um little tapas Christmas tree that I did with the balloon kisses previous but anyway it's all good I'm very happy with that now happy that I did scrape the bits off that I needed to and I'm sort of all over the place I know but you have to do these things to explore and to show you guys that it's okay to scrape and start again or half scrape and start again so I'm going to leave this one as a reflection swipe for sure so until tomorrow, my lovelies, I am here every single day. So please join me. Thank you so much for subscribing. And if you want to show us or share your work, join our Australian Acrylic Pouring Group on Facebook. 
you can be from any uh, part of the world to be a part of that group and um, there's lots of help there for beginners so until tomorrow bye for now